Hello players, this is me, this game's here again, and I welcome you back to World of Tanks Epic Battle. Now it's been a long time since our last Epic Battle, but um, yeah, I received some really nice games, so more Epic Battles coming up, and this time in Artillery. Yeah, weird to get Epic Games in Artillery, but this one is really epic. You're going to see why soon, so at first... Aiming down here just to hit a few scouts who are trying to get down here. But seems like nobody at the moment. Uh, so this game is played by Legend Beast in his FV 304. The most fun artillery out there right now. And let's see how he did. What kind of epic battle. So yeah, type 58. And that gun has some really nice gun elevation and angle to shoot. Okay, first shot off and penetration on type 58. Really nice. I like the rate of fire on FE. Just epic. And ISU took the kill. If there is an overkill, then this was one. ISU shell into 36 HP. And boom. So D71. He got through just after we moved from the first position. Behind the rock, we don't have a really nice shot on him. Moving and seems like on death, death hill, northwest corner, there is going to have some action. So T71 zooming in and let's see if we can hit those sneaky shots. Indeed we can. And look at that rate of fire. We can fire our next shell before T-71 repair his tracks. <laughs> what an epic tank. Or artillery. So two more shots like that and he should be done. Penetration, <laughs> Penetration always helps. 455 hit. Not bad, so one more should do it. And direct hit. Perfect, perfect play, man. Scout taken down. I hate T71. They can be pretty nasty targets. Or scout. Blind shot. Just in case. And I like that uh, you can carry a lot of shells in FV. Not like in German's artillery, I mean, uh, in Krill, running out of ammo is not a big question. And look at that gun arc, you can shoot behind that hill easily. D44, one hit into him, so one more should do it, but he's down. Oh, D34. That was close. Just hit under his track. I guess. Nice, he moved just into perfect position and we were able to penetrate him. So Tiger B. Pounce. Yeah, he was angled pretty nicely and even HG shells can bounce. D34 aiming at his back, so hopefully some penetration. Yeah, we did hit on top of his engine, but no penetration. Unlucky for us, that should have been penetration shot. Nice. And uh, Legend Beast is just nailing them like there is no tomorrow. Every time he's reloaded, shell is flying. This is how you should play artillery. And playing with FE is not as boring as on other artilleries. I mean, you take one fire or higher tier artilleries. You take one shot, you're, <laughs> you basically wait 45 seconds to take another one. In here you can just bam, 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 nail them. And T-34 down. Our second kill, Tiger B. Trapped in perfect position. And another penetration. So, 5 minutes into game, and we have 3139 damage done. 
epic and our third kill this guy is just beasting it up as you can see on his name legend beast <laughs> fuck their shit up indeed so who's next we can see tiger one on minimap Okay, he's in our range. He's getting flanked by D44. Okay. D34 finished him off. Next target, please. Uh, we know Type 59 is still up there somewhere. Let's get into position. Come on, come on, come on, can we save that SC-100? Come on, come on. Ah. Too late. 122.44 finished him off. Blind shots. Ah, uh, not blind shots. I mean... Uh, yeah, I fucked up there. <laughs> now it's blind shots. And in FV, you can do it because you have shells to waste. So, where he could be? With that rate of fire, with that amount of shells, you are able to do that. Hopefully, the T28 is spotting him soon. Hello! And. Indeed, enemy vehicle destroyed. Well played. Our fourth kill. T28. Prototype. Just out of trains. Or, yeah. The DMX is out of the range right now. But I think we can hit behind that hill if we move. And this is exactly what Legend Beast does. Side shots on French tanks is just bread and butter for artillery. Easy penetrations. Uh, this time no penetration, but he's tracked. And once again, look at that rate of fire. We can shoot another round before he's repaired his tracks. And penetration. So one more penetration, and he is done. And bam! Nice! 4500 damage done in tier 6 artillery. Are you fucking kidding me? With 5 kills. So, as you can see, I love that team. They're just saying nice shooting arty, nice legend. Perfect team. And uh, if I'm not mistaken, um, yeah, you need the last one. So they are giving him to Dop Gun basically. What a team. I want you all guys in my team. So Hummel left. Let's speed up a little. We don't need the driving in here. So he's not on northwest corner, so so only place he can be is or, or not northwest, on the yeah, west corner. So the only place he can uh, be is southwest corner. And there he is. Firing on the move, hit, nice. Come on, come on, reload, reload. And. Uh, bad. Freaking top gun on tier 6 artillery. Well, let's be honest, you're not going to see that score on tier 6 artillery very often. Freaking 4,900 experience. Doubled, but still crazy. Top Gun, 92,000 credits. A lot of damage tanks, hit tanks, critically damage tanks. All good stuff in here. And 4,818 damage done with 6 kills and 1.6 thousand raw experience. <laughs> Just epic game, man.
Top damage tank tier 6 artillery in tier 8 game. In heavy tier 8 game. And as we can see on the enemy side also Hummel top damage tank. So good game Hummel as well. Shots fired 28, target hits 20, really good ratio. Enemies damage 9, enemies destroyed 6, 85,000 profit with uh, mission reward as well. So GG, you deserve that. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that battle. I really did. Um, thank you for sending that game to us, Legend Beast. And if you guys have any battles like this, what you would like to share, then send your games into these moments at gmail.com and maybe you can be all in our next episode. You never know. So as always guys, I thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you had a great time and I get you next time. Bye.